is mountain climbers. So come into a high plank position. I'll move your mat to you. And you're going to draw your legs in. I always prefer doing slow mountain climbers, just like I need. I'm using my core. Or you can go into the fast version. You can go crossover or straight. So let's try the advanced one. Crossover to the opposite elbow. I'm keeping my back nice and straight. So I will lift your head up. Neutral spine. Let's go for the slower version. You can mix it up based on how you're feeling. Don't look at your family members. Just focus on yourself. This is your workout. Your time. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, guys. So, let's do last exercise. It's either going to be a jog or even a walk on the spot. If it's a light jog, that's fine. Or you're going to get all out. I want you to do a max sprint on the spot. Really, really go for it. So, keep the core in. Imagine we're in a race, yeah? So, nice and slow. Three, two, one. Let's go, okay. The Meta family are going for it here. We are all doing the advanced version. Come on, come on, 20 seconds. You can walk it out if you need to. Stop, take a breather, listen to your body. 15 seconds, go all out if you can. Come on, let's burn some calories. Let's get those endorphins released. I guarantee you'll feel good after this. Come on, three, two, and one. Excellent. Last exercise I'm going to show you, and I'm going to pause this for a second, is a press up. So I didn't want to rush this. You've got time to recover. You can either do a wall press up. So hopefully you can see this wall over here. You're going to grab a wall. You can do a very simple version by getting your arms nice and wide. Depending on how far back your feet are, the harder it is. I've got a lovely straight line from my head down to my feet, and I'm bringing my chest towards the wall. So that's the easiest version. Then, if you want, you can go to box. So, guys, I'm giving you a little breather here while I show you some technique. Obviously, this is like a PT session, so we can do the box press up. So my knees are directly under my hips. And I'm coming down. A common mistake is to get your face in between your hands. I want you to bring your chest between your hands. If you're more advanced, go for the three-quarter. But I want your glutes and hips to come all the way down into it. So I've got a straight line from my head down to the back of my knees. And if you're hardcore metal, I'm expecting you to be doing full press-ups. But all the way down, we've got 30 seconds of these. So find your option. Would you like to do box? Okay, I am going to watch you guys. So we're going to go in five seconds. Let's go. Everybody chosen their version. This is the last exercise. Yes, lovely exercise snacking here. Let's go. 30 seconds of press-ups. Do your version. Try and aim for your chest between your hands. Core engaged. This is recruiting so many muscles, not just your upper body. Come on, let's really work it out. You've got 15 seconds. If it gets hard, don't compromise your form. Drop the knees down if you're on four. If you're on three quarter and it's hard, bring the knees in. And go for the box. Three, two, and one. No high-fiving today. We have to keep our social distancing. How is everybody feeling? How are you feeling, guys? Woo! Feeling good. So, let's stretch. I would love to do another round with you guys. I did promise it was going to be a short exercise snack. But my heart rate woo, is super high. And I didn't even do the whole workout. I was showing you and teaching you. So, let's stretch our hamstrings. I'm going to bring one foot forward. I'm going to flex the toes, keep it nice and straight. Now, I don't want you to just collapse forward. I want you to feel it. Bring your chest towards your thigh. You might go just a few inches, because when you're falling forward, you're not going to feel it as much. So keep your hands on your waist. 
and really lengthen that hamstring. Can you bring your toes towards you? You'll feel that stretch hopefully all the way down the calf into your ankles. What's your heart rate, Manol? Is it high? Yes, it's I feel recovering. Good. And then let's try the other side. We want to hold all stretches for 20 to 30 seconds. Take some nice, deep, long breaths. Sometimes saying 30 seconds scares people, so I just say aim for three to four. Really nice, deep breaths. We want to get that heart rate down. Woo! I'm feeling hot. I've got my feel good t shirt on. Has got a little bit of <laughs> ventilation on this one. You see, it's getting hot. So, three, two, and one. Now, if you're near a carpet or if you have a towel or a mat or anything to protect your knees, you're going to come down onto the floor. It's not going to be too painful for the knees, so don't worry if you haven't got a mat. But if you have, grab it now. We're going to do one of my favourite moves, yoga based moves, this is such a great one, I do it every day, it's cat-cow, so I'm really sticking my tailbone out, I'm lifting my chin and I'm getting a stretch from the top all the way down to my belly button and then I'm going to exhale, round the back out and I'm really working on trying to round out my thoracic spine, this is the area that we all carry a lot of tension in. And now working from home is going to pose challenges for adults, working from home for students as well, different setup. So look after your back, your spine. Inhale and exhale. Really round it up. Open those vertebrae out. One more. I'm hoping your heart rate's gone down a little bit. And exhale. We're going to fall into a lovely child's pose. My other favourite stretch. So try and get your glutes towards your heels, your head towards the mat. I'm lengthening my fingertips as far as I can. And just breathe into your ribcage, a nice deep breath. Now, with all the stress and anxiety with coronavirus, yoga, meditation, just some simple deep breathing techniques are gonna really help people. So enjoy this moment. Try and stay positive, maybe have a little bit of an affirmation while you're here, a bit of gratitude for what we have got rather than what we're facing. Breathe, lovely, and then you're going to slowly curl up. I'm going to tuck my toes under, so I'm ready to stand up into a lovely forward fold. So if you can see me, my legs are straight, I'm letting everything go, I'm stretching out my hamstrings again. Can you guys feel this? Let your head, shoulders, neck, everything relax. We're going to rock side to side and just breathe. Again, really important to just surrender and focus on this moment, how you're feeling right now. Hopefully feeling good that you've done this great little bit of exercise snacking, releasing those endorphins, boosting our immune systems, and then come to the middle and then slowly roll up, roll up, roll up my spine. My son has already got up there, all the way up. I'm going to put my hands in the back of my back. I'm trying to bring my elbows all the way back. I did try this with Sahil in the gym and I was shocked that I could actually squeeze his elbows right together. Um, so I think we forget how flexible our young children are and with Working at desks, obviously now working from home, it's going to have challenges that we're all going to end up rounding out as we're looking at our screens. So really open up, prevent kyphosis, get that lovely chest stretch in. We're going to wide legs and we're going to take a lovely big inhale. Lots of positivity and exhale any negative thoughts out. Good, lovely breathing, Menor. Inhale all the way up. Hands are going to meet at the top, down to your heart centre. Thank God for what we have got. Thank your bodies and thank you so much for joining me. I would love you guys to take a little sweaty selfie or a picture of where you're at and send it to me or tag me on Instagram. I will be posting those pictures out. Um, I'm hoping everyone is feeling good. Let me read some of your uh, comments. Oh, Cyrus saying she misses her workouts with me. Hirol has said, 
Um, I was waiting for it the whole day. Looked up at eight o'clock. Oh no, you missed it, Sonia. Okay, well I'll be doing more guys. Would you like me to do some more? I guess that's the question. I'm planning to do a lot more. I think we're all gonna need this break. Hi Rue, I'm so glad you joined us. Well done. You loved it. Well, you must have smashed it. Are you feeling good, guys? I'm loving these comments. Uh, save the live for later, please. Yes, I have managed to record it, actually. So I will stick that up. It was awesome. Well done, you. And that's A, Hassan. Very good. Great workout with the simple options. Good. I will do it again, Rue and Hirol. Thank you so much, guys. And I've got Ratch. Oh, you miss the gym so much, I know. I'm missing it, but guys, we can do stuff from home. It's not gonna be hard. I'm gonna try and help everyone. I'm gonna try and do a lovely seven day snack workout. It's gonna be like a program where we're gonna do different body parts. So it's almost like proper training. Gillian, hello, yes. Do you want one tomorrow? Who wants one tomorrow? Yay, great workout, thank you. Well done, Alex, thanks for interviewing me this morning on the radio and you held your promise. You came out and did it. I'm loving these comments, guys, so I'm gonna carry on. And Jay Shree, more sessions would be great. Well, it's your feedback. Um, I'm planning to do this structured program. We're gonna get people feeling good. I would love the kids to take part. Um, if you are a mum, you're probably a little bit worried about how things are gonna pan out in your household. I have been cooking and cleaning extra, extra hard. So um, it is gonna be hard. Can we do some more yoga? Yes, I would love to. And yoga is gonna be key right now, as I was talking about with breathing techniques. Jay, well done, please keep going. Guys, this is so great. If you can send me some pictures. Thank you, Menor, for tidying up. Yeah. Well done, you get very neat point. Sahil, how did you find it? Come and tell everyone. It was really good, yeah. I think we should go more often. Oh, you enjoyed it. That's great. Just for 15 minutes. And Preet, well done. Your little girl enjoyed it. Well done, go Preet. So send me some pictures and I will try and put this whole video up on um, IGTV so you can do it again if you missed it. Don't worry. Um, I'm thinking what sort of timing works for everyone. I was going to do a poll on Instagram. Um, I'm thinking of potentially doing something daytime where we've got a little bit more energy. Um, maybe sort of a family workout when, you know, people are all together um, if we are going into isolation. So I am going to post this out, guys. Thank you so much. Have a lovely evening. I hope you're all feeling good. Well done. We're going to do Corona high fives and namaste. Well done, everyone.